guys. Hey guys, I know what's going on before this video even starts. Be sure to subscribe. Uh, please tell your friends to subscribe. And please, if you're part of the Con Squad, please also subscribe. And guys, this will be the last, last final call for the Ford. For the, um. Rewind. 2003. Ford Windstar. This van is 16, 16 years old. Got the keys right here, and we're gonna do one last startup. So without further ado, let's jump on it. Ah, <sighs> the old van. You will be a mess. Sorry, that was a little weird. So yeah guys, let's do one last startup. With 123,000 miles. Wow. Listen to that 16 year old engine. Wow. I wonder if we could just take it for a quick spin, but as you guys can see, there is nothing else in the back. No seats, no nothing. Whoa, guys, look. Look at the coolant gauge. <laughs> That's not the camera. I know th I know that for sure. But guys, look at the coolant gauge. Dead ass. I'm not doing anything. Maybe s sometimes a few revs works. But wow, guys. This is how you know the van needs to go. Dead ass, guys. Dead ass. Turn the radio up. Bass. Walter Boykin's ensemble performs serenade for winds by Antonin. No one cares. Um, you got your cruise control. Oh, guys, look, it's stayed. It actually stayed! No way! I kind of want to drive this around the parking lot one time. Because this is the first time that I've actually sat in the Windstar. Well, minus yesterday. But, guys. I was just closing the door for all the noise and stuff. But look. Brake lamp. Check left brake lamp. Check rear tail lamp. Brake lamp. Uh, you're throwing so many codes, Mr. Ford. But as you guys can see, that the RPM dial is broken. Yep, the RPM dial is broken. The question is, does it still reverse? Nope, that's reverse. Yep, it slow reverses. Making sure I don't hit crap. Wow. Oh, this van so needs to go because my foot is basically to the floor for the brakes. Isn't that wild? And yes, guys, it has the fun brake. 
as you guys know, it has the fun brake and stuff like that. Wow. Guys, this van is going. This van is going. Ah! But yeah. Wow. I wonder if mom will let me take it on the parking lot one time. What's this? No way. They said infotainment. Wow. Light. Light. So, yeah, guys. Comment down below what you guys think of the one and only Savage Ford Windstar. Got some things in there. Got some... Yeah, it's time for it to go. <laughs> yeah, it's time for it to go. Because that's also shattered. If you guys didn't know. That right there, my friends, is also shattered. Wow. That's crazy, guys. Crazy. I'm surprised the power steering still works. Haha. -ha. So, yeah, guys. We're going to shut her off. And that's going to be that of the one and only of the one and only 2003 Ford Windstar. Wait. Key fob doesn't work. Wow. Just wow. Guys, it's going away. Just say a few last little prayers for this van. Hopefully it doesn't go to some like crack dealer or something like that. Not crackers, crack dealer, I mean drugs. So, yeah guys. All the rust right there and there. And all of this. Wow. 4.6 liter V6. 4.6 liter V6 in this beast. And maybe later, guys, we'll do a startup and little driving review of the Hyundai Santa Fe. But, guys, from 2003 to 2018, this van will be missed.